The course for memorizing the examples of the phylum Chordata. So under Chordata, the Chordata is divided into Eurochordata, Cephalochordata, Vertebrata, right? So how can we memorize the examples of Eurochordata? Euro is a currency of European countries and USA currency is dollar. So USA, U for Eurochordata, S for Salpa, A for Ascaria. Dollar means Doliolum. USA currency is dollar with that Eurochordata examples we can remember. Now coming to Cephalochordata. Cephalics means head and brain. So like that. Brain should take you to brachiostoma. And Cephalochordata is between Eurochordata and Vertebrata. Between means Amphi. Amphi means Amphioxus or Lancelets. That's it Cephalochordata. Now coming to Cyclostomes. Cyclostomes means they don't have jaws, right? They don't have jaws. Egneta, they have circular mouth. So the code for memorizing the examples of cyclostomes are cyclone will mix large particles. Cyclone is for cyclostoma. Mix is for mixine. Large means lamprey. Particle means teromycin. So teromycin is called lamprey only, right? So cyclone mixes large particles. Cyclone for cyclostoma, mix for mixine, large for lamprey, particle for teromycin. That's it. Examples of cyclostomes are easily remembering. Now coming to chondrichthys, cartilage fishes. The code for cartilage fishes is PCT, DCT. In nephron, we have two parts, proximal convoluted tubule and distal convoluted tubule. Here we are using the same codes, PCT and DCT. P for pristis, C is for cartilage fishes, T for torpedo, D is for dogfish, C is carcarodon and T for trigon. Pristis, cartilage fish, torpedo, dogfish, carcarodon and trigon. Pristis is called sawfish. Torpedo produces electricity, electric ray. Dogfish is colidon. Carcarodon is great white shark. Trigon, it has, it's a venom fish. It produces poison in its tail, stingray it is. Now, PCT, DCT is a code for chondrichthys. Now, coming to ostrichthys. For ostrichthys, I don't have any code. We'll just remember the examples. Marine fishes, example, hippocampus and exotus. Under freshwater fishes, we have Katla, Magur and Libio. Aquarium fishes, we have Betta and Terophis. Now coming to amphibians. Amphibians, they'll be in water. They breathe in the rainy season. So, Barish is the code for amphibians. B-A-R-I-S-H. B for Buffo. A is for amphibia. R is for Rana. I is for Istiophis. S for Salamandra. H for Hyla. B-A-R-I-S-H. Buffo means toad. Rana means frog. Istiophis is limbless amphibian. Salamandra means salamander. Hyla is tree frog. So, Barish is a code for amphibians. Now, coming to the next class, Reptilia. The code for memorizing the examples of Reptilia is Tank U C4. Tank U C4. T H A N K Tank U. Y we will convert to V. C4 means C we are going to write four times. T for Tustedo. H for hemidectylus, A for alligator, N for NASA, K for crate, Y is converted to V, I told, Y para. Four C's we are going to write, Calotus, Chameleon, Cleon and Crocodile. Tustedo is tortoise, right? Hemidectylus, what is hemidectylus? It is wall lizard. Alligator means alligator, NASA is cobra, crate is bangerus, Y para is viper. Now, Calotus is garden lizard. Hemidectylus is wall lizard. Calotus is garden lizard. And Chameleon is tree lizard. Cleon is turtle. Crocodile means crocodile only. So, thank you. C4 is a code for reptile. Now, coming to the next class, Aves. Now, the code to memorize Aves is Sita ne Sruti ko Coca Cola Pilaya. Sita ne Sruti ko Coca Cola Pilaya. Sita means Sitacula. Ne, neophron. Sruti, strutio. Ko means corvus. Coca cola means columba. Pilaya will come with penguin and pavo. Sitacula is parrot. Neophron means vulture. Strutio means ostrich. Corvus is crow. Columba is pigeon. Penguin, scientific name is actinoditis. Pavo means parrot. That's it. Sita ne, strutio, Coca cola, pilaya. With this, we can memorize the code of A's. 
Now coming to mammalia, I don't think we need to code to memorize mammals because mammals are the animals what we see around. Rat, cat, dog, monkey, uh, tiger, lion, platypus, pteropus, macropus, bellonoptera, all these are the examples of mammals. Hope this class will be helpful for you to memorize the examples of animal kingdom. We will we'll meet soon in the next classes. Thank you.